Okay, it's Rob Shapiro from Technique Peak. Now we're gonna to go to the knee. We're gonna do some ligamentous stress tests. The first one we're gonna do is a ACL test for a Lachman test. One of the keys that people have trouble with, sometimes it's hard to grasp, so there's multiple ways to do it. But the key is when you bring the leg up, is make sure it's at, flexed up about 30 degrees and turned out a little bit. You wanna relax the hamstrings. And when you grasp, to get that interior drawer part of it, or the Lachman's part of it, you have to take the, I take the gastroc on the medial side, kind of pull it around, and then grab on almost to the tibial tubercle. So I really have a control of it. Other hand's gonna go on the femur, and make sure the patient's relaxed. So you take up that, and then you kind of wanna go forward. And the key to it, if you could see, let me go through it again. If you see through it, so I'm out here a little bit, and as I key through, as I, as I bring it forward, I wanna have that little, I wanna feel like it grasps. So the key is, think of a, a string or a rope, the rope has to, you have to have that feeling for a normal ACL. While we're doing that for ACLs, we, could, we had a Lachman, then we could do it an anterior draw. So you put them in that position for a neutral draw, sit in his foot, come underneath, make sure his hamstrings are relaxed so I give him that pressure up, right? And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna grab the tibia from the back, hands along the front, and I'm just gonna sit back and do the glide. Now the key, remember, you want to make sure that they're starting in that nice neutral spot. Sometimes if they have a PCL, they're actually in a posterior glide, and it seems like a lot of motion. So the key is here, make sure the tibial tubercle is not pushed backwards. And then when you come through, just give it that, really sit back on it. Okay? If you want to change the angle, you could have anterior medial, anterior lateral instability. You could turn the foot out a little bit, do the same thing. And you can turn the foot in a little bit into your medial instability. So relax the hamstrings, come back through here, and really lean back to get that glide. Okay, you're looking for how many millimeters, really end feel for the Lachman, and this how many millimeters it translates. Okay, it's Rob Shapiro from Technique Peak.